the show's coverage of Major League Baseball is on the air. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the L.A. Dodgers and the Long Ball Beasts. Pedro Martinez takes the mound for the Beasts today. What do you have for us on him, Danny? Hey, we're taking a look at one of the top pitchers in the game. This guy has over 200 career victories, and he'd like to add another one to this list. This guy's been a really good pitcher for a long time, and right now he's showing no signs of slowing down. It'll be interesting to watch him work in this one here. Stepping up is Mookie Betts. He will lead this one off today. The right field, Mookie. Yeah. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. And we're underway here this afternoon and off to a fast start as well as this is lined back into center field for a base hit. Oh, okay. I see how it's going to be. You're going to implore that. You're going to use the ambush tactics and not playing nice right there. Usually you're supposed to take the 0 pitch to start the game. He wasn't paying attention. Here's Corey Seeger. And it's grounded just foul down the line. Yanked hard but foul to the right. Betts aboard here at first with nobody out. Smoke toward the hole and that's through for a hit. The throw will hold him at second but the go ahead runs in scoring position now with still nobody out. Hey they're seeing this pitcher well right now. They were obviously paying attention in a hitters meeting. He's found a barrel to the first two guys to start this game. Now he's got to worry about the middle of the order. And on the first pitch, he hits it in the air to right. Guerrero is there to put it away for route number one. And he is in there. That is good. The first baseman, Max Muncy. And that will bring up the versatile Max Muncy. And they're runners at the corners now. From the stretch. Now Muncie with a swing and a deep drive to right. Gone. And that one had some extra distance. Three run home run down the line in right and the Dodgers have now taken a three nothing lead. Yeah he's looked pretty shaky from the first pitch and things just kind of spiraled out of control from there. I think these guys smelled blood in the water and they punctuated with a three run job and an early lead. Here now is Will Smith. As he'll come up empty there as he misses the off speed pitch for strike one. Fastball was too much for him there, swung right through it. This is why you pay the price of admission right here. Power on power. My money's on the pitcher. Thomas has a play. And he brings it in for the second out of the inning. That's exactly what they wanted out of that pitch up in the zone. They took him up the ladder and he couldn't get up to it. So that was an easy pop out. Well executed pitch there. To the plate now Chris Taylor. As he swings and lifts it in the air out to left field. Carter gets there for the catch and that ends the inning. But the big blow of the inning comes right here, a three-run home run. Bottom of the first coming up from Atlanta. It's now 3-0 Los Angeles. 
Clayton Kershaw will be on the mound for the boys in blue. Dan Plezak, what's the word on him? Hey, this guy has a four pitch repertoire, right? And those are a lot of nice options to have. You can go hard, soft, you can go in and out. And anytime you have four pitches, if you can throw them for strikes, you have the big advantage. And now in the box, Craig Biggio. He'll lead things off here in the bottom Leading half of the first. The, beast, the second baseman, Craig Biggio. The pitch. As he'll swing and hit this one hard, but foul off to the left and out of play. <laughs> Lifted into the air out towards center field. Chasing after it is Taylor. He gets there and makes the play for the first out. Batting second, the shortstop, Barry Larkin. Now into the box, Barry Larkin. First pitch on its way. Rip down the line. And this will stay inside the third base bag. A fair ball. And this one will bounce into the wall. Man, I love this angle. Looking right down the line. You can see that he generates his power from this lower half, taking it down the line for a clean double. Great look there. Standing in now, Shepard Jones. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Taylor is there. Makes the play, and there are two gone now. And he'll make it up to third on the fly ball as he's in there now with two away. That was a nice that job cool. to track that one down the alley because it Water definitely here. saved a run from scoring. Go Instead, Vero. he's only able to move up to third. So here's the cleanup hitter, Vladimir Guerrero, trying to cash in here in his first at bat with a runner at third and two gone. He's set. Here it comes. Here's a fly ball well hit. Back goes Pollock to the track, to the wall, and that one is gone! A two-run homer for Vladimir Guerrero, as it's now a 3-2 ball game. Well, they were a lot more comfortable up three than they are now, only up by one. That just goes to show you one pitch, one two-run shot, and the entire complexion of a game can change just like that. That is good. The first baseman. At the plate now, Frank Thomas. Thomas. And he's first pitch swinging here as he lines this one into left field for a base hit. Just an absolute laser that time, screaming off the bat, if you will. And show track tells us it went out at 112 miles an hour. Those are the line drives you can hear as they go by. Stepping in now, Joe Carter. And he turns this one around high and deep to center field. Looking up is Taylor. Gone! It's a two-run homer for Joe Carter as they take the lead four to three. Boy, not the way you'd like to start a game, right? First inning, you come in, you give up two home runs. We'll see if he can regroup right here. It's not easy to sometimes come back from that. Plate, Buds Rodriguez. The catcher. Pitch is popped up. Rodriguez. Smith is there to put it away and finally put an end to the inning. So four runs in the inning, and they come on the strength of the two big flies. We'll move on to the second now in Atlanta. 
It's a lead for the long ball era, four to three. New inning set to get underway, and that'll bring up A.J. Pollock. The left fielder, number 11. Infield in the overshift here, now the pitch. Hit high and deep to right center. Right fielder giving chase. He makes the catch, a great effort to get there and record the first out of the inning. The second baseman, Gavin Lux. The batter will be Gavin Lux. First delivery to him. Sends that one out of play for strike one. Pulled high in the air out to right field. And there to take it in is Guerrero, and that's out number two. Matt Beatty will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Number 45, Matt Beatty. First pitch of the A.B. now. He swings and sends it on a line to right center. Guerrero is there, and they breeze through this half inning as the side is retired. Dodgers retired on just four pitches. Still down a run. It's 4-3. Dennis Santana, a six foot two inch right hander, jogs in to take over on the mound. Number 77, Dennis Santana. Last half of the second set to go, and that brings up Grady Sizemore. The center fielder, Grady. First pitch on its way. Hit hard on the ground to second, and that'll just sneak past the glove, and it should be a base hit. They've gotten their hits in deep counts. They've gotten their hits in early counts. This has been a real onslaught. Yeah, you can look at it one of two ways, Matty. Either they have a ton of respect for the man on the mound, and they are just going to ambush tactics, and it seems to work for them. Or you can look at it the other way. They're just getting lucky. David Ortiz will come on to pinch hit now with a runner at first and nobody out. From the stretch, here's the pitch. He swings and hits it foul off to the right and out of play. Now a flare out toward right center. Lux is under it, one away. The batter, number seven, second baseman, Craig Bizio. Back to the top of the order now, and digging in now at the plate will be Craig Biggio. Here's the first pitch to him. Stung into the gap in right center for what should be extra bases. And they'll have runners at second and third following the one out double. And he's in safely at third as a run will score on the play as well. Here's another look at it right here as he drives it right between the two outfielders heading towards the right center field wall. He was flying out of the box, so I think he was thinking triple all the way. By the time they get it back in, he's safely into third. Into the box, Barry Larkin as he lines it out to center. And a base hit, and that'll get the run in from third. Yeah, Dan, he's got to feel pretty good about that. Not only did he have a great A.B., first pitch hacking, but he smoked that ball to mix in a ribby no. knock. Well, he did. He must have had a pretty good plan of attack walking into that batter's box, and he had an idea of the pitch that he was going to get, and, boy, he sure turned it loose and buggy with that one. Into the box now, Chipper Jones, and he'll take this over to the bag for the out, but meanwhile, the runner moves into scoring position at second. Now Here's one that you don't right see field. too often, right? Safe at second base, but Go out at first. Zero. Great hustle there from the runner going into second. Really showed off his speed. In now, Vladimir Guerrero. 
The swing and lift a ball fouled off to the left and out of play. A couple of RBIs for him already and a chance for more here. Lifted down the line and left. Just not able to let that breaking ball travel enough right there. You could see his eyes light up when that popped out of the pitcher's hands, and he just hooked it foul. Taylor will get there, and he puts it away to retire the side. So it's two runs on three hits, no errors, and a runner left on. We played two full. The Beasts lead this one 6-3. to three. Your Jack Morris, please. a right-handed reliever standing 6-3, gets the ball now out of the bullpen. Top of the third set to get underway, and up next, one of the terrific talents in the game, Mookie Betts. First pitch on its way. Swing and a liner. But this lands foul for the first strike. Loud contact by Mookie and a ball carrying well to left field. Gone to lead off the inning. A solo home run there for Mookie. And they cut the gap here. It's now six to four. Oh man he got hurt his second pitch since coming in and he serves one up a reliever's worst nightmare and a big confidence boost to the lineup. Let's see if he can rebound. Here's Corey Seager. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Center fielder giving chase. And he tracks it down. Nice play for the first out. Next for the Dodgers, Justin Turner. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. And now pitch on the way. Line hard. But a foul ball here, 0 and 1. Morris has thrown north of 3,800 big league innings in his career, and with greater than 2,400 punch outs, he stands in the territory of greats like Dennis Eckersley, Louis Tiant, and Andy Pettit. And it's fouled away. Drilled on the ground to short. Oh, look at the sliding stop. What a play. So two out, nobody on. And that'll bring up the big bat of Max Muncy. That last at bat, that showed me something. It's not that easy to hit a changeup over 400 plus feet out of the ballpark. So this guy gets some good extension, strong wrist, and this guy's got some terrific bat speed. The wind up and the 0 1. Here's a ball hit high down the right field line. This ball has a chance and it is gone. A solo shot down the line in right. And this will make things interesting at this point. It's now a 6 5 game. Another excellent swing right there. That's multiple home runs in the same inning. Watch yourself. You're missing over the heart of the plate. At the plate now, Will Smith. As he grounds one briskly to short. Fielded cleanly. Throw in time, and the ball game is over. Very rarely do you see a lot of offense in a three-inning game. This certainly was the exception to the rule. Runs scored by both teams and a fun one to watch. A one-run game, 6-5 to five, the final today. The long ball beasts scored in every single inning on the way to victory. Pedro Martinez pitches well enough to get the W. Clayton Kershaw lasted only an inning in the losing effort. So that'll just about do it. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. 
time, this has been a presentation of MLB The Show. For more, don't forget to check out theshow.com. Here now 